Hotep, this is African Symbolism and Entertainment Part 4. Let's get back into this. I'm going to play two different clips. Let's see how strong your third eyes are. I'm not going to tell you what I see until after the two clips are over. Let's see what you can find. Arise, my winged dragon of Ra! This time you have no way to defend yourself, Pharaoh! <laughs> Behold the return of my Egyptian god! It's locked in that sphere of light! That's correct! And only I can release it! So stand back as I recite the ancient chant <laughs> to unlock Ra! Great beast of the sky, please hear my cry. Transform thyself from orb of light and bring me victory in this fight. Envelop the desert with your glow and cast your rage upon my foe. Now, here's the second clip. My move! I play Monster Reborn! <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna tell you what I saw real quick. The spine connecting to the brain and the pineal gland surrounded by neurons. The placement of hands in a ritual-like manner. The sun rising, the comedic royalty pose, and a special chant or prayer, and then Heru appears. In the second clip, the Kundalini rising from his root chakra. You could even see the root chakra color. And then you see a kundalini-like symbol in the middle of the Heru wings before it rises and appears. Okay, we know that Heru eventually merges with Ra, right? And Ra is a sun god, right? Well, let's watch Heru transform into Ra, and then in the second clip, let's watch Ra take down set. First, I'll activate Ra's ability of instant attack so it can attack now! But that's just the beginning of your troubles! Someone wanna fill me in here? It looks like Raw is transforming. Behold the true form of Raw! Great deity of the sun! I ask thee to transform thyself! Now, burn through the shadows! With your fiery rage! holographic cards in his game of Doom Monsters goes to the card graveyard after the player is done using the card. Maverick's strategy is to keep resurrecting Ra or Heru from the underworld using a magic card and attack his enemy. And now, I'll activate the magic card that will end this duel! Monster Reborn! It's over! I shall bring forth my winged dragon of Ra in its most devastating form ever! Egyptian god Phoenix! Next I'll give up 1,000 life points to activate Ra's special ability! Now, my great beast of the sky! I'll choose to play Monster Reborn Pharaoh, which allows me to revive my mighty winged dragon of Ra! Now, my dragon, emerge in your unstoppable Phoenix mode! Neutralize the power of yours! In this mood, Ra is immortal for one whole turn! So nothing you do can stop it! <laughs> he says Ra is immortal for one whole turn. In other words, Ra rises and is immortal for the whole day, and then the sun sets until the next day. I have a few more clips to show you. In this next clip, I'm not going to say anything. You need to see it though, it's a very interesting clip. Let's say it like that. Meet the most feared creature in Duel Monsters! The mighty Exodia Necros! It's the 
last monster you'll ever see, my boy! I've waited years for this moment! Check me, Seto! <laughs> knew I was destined for greatness. I just need to collect all the right pieces so I can put together my destiny. My Pharaoh, were you able to recover your lost memories? Yes. Then after 5,000 years, our family's task is finally complete. You're right. And the seven millennium items are gathered together at last. My king... I know. Huh? Now I must seal them away forever so I can enter the spirit world. To the spirit world thou may proceed, but first thou must complete this deed. Yes, my ancient name has been revealed. I am King Atum! I know, and it's all thanks to you. Now what? I mean, what's next? You know, now that you saved the world. Wait for the next bad guy? No attempt. There will not be another. You have conquered the embodiment of pure darkness from which all evil is born. So I'm done? No, but you are close. With the help of your friends, you've nearly fulfilled your destiny. That is why your spirit returned to this world after 5,000 years. So you could rescue mankind once again from the inevitable return of the Shadow Games.